that completed the call to law enforcement quickly. They said they're sending someone. Typical troll brigade mafia recruits, but I can't see the fucking eye. It looks like he's indicating to somebody. Hmm. Now you messing with the wrong motherfucker, man. I've dealt with this shit for years. You've got a gang of stalkers behind you. A bunch of pedophiles and miscreants. Trolls. Yeah, you're the one taunting a man. This lighting position is horrible. Yeah, you heard me call. I. Yeah, I don't respond that well to threats. It's not a threat. it's not a threat. Oh, it's not a threat. You said you're going to run me out of town, and that's not a threat. That's the most traditional, oldest threat that there is. Well, no community wants me anywhere, so take a number, take a seat. Institution that I'm behind. Richard and the Troll Brigade Mafia, the people that recruited you. Nomad, interesting term. Uh huh. Interesting that you picked the late evening hour to harass me. I had a job to do today. I just got done with dinner. I just forgot. Mm. Walked on over and thought I'd just do that. All I'm doing is standing here watching you not look funny. I didn't say anything to you. I didn't threaten you. I'm just standing here. Except the part about running me out of town. That is literally what you told me. I'm suggesting that I leave. Oh, that's that's a big improvement. Hmm. Yeah. Well, the Troll Brigade Mafia does, and you're the ones communicating with them. The people that posted that on your board are recruiting people to attack me. You're not the first. You're one of many. You're the exact type of person that would attack me for the perversion. He's the one asking them how long it's going to take them. There's no way I, I would know. And that ain't going to work, Sonny. The Troll Brigade Mafia follows me wherever I go. They'll just recruit more people. 
Yeah, but you heard about this on message boards. Really, you sure it's mine? What was the name of the channel? The name was Colton Wood Vlogs? Uh, yeah, it's got my face, but Colton Wood Vlogs, V-L-O-G-S. Not gonna happen. Earning your money. And that will bump a serious felony for the Colton Wood Vlogs project. Here's why it's dangerous. Now Richard made it clear that there was a new impersonation account this week. I already reported that. Good thing I did. <laughs> huh. What business is it of yours? What my plans are? I notice you really aren't coming for me either. You've got the height advantage. You've got the high ground. You're no threat to me, but you're going to run me out of town. You're suggesting I leave. You're telling me to pack it up. I got the names right. right? Town Center, yeah. You make me famous on YouTube, bro? Yeah. That's up to the audience. You're going on there. You know what? I had an Instagram, but your buddies flagged it down because it was full of screenshots of their perverted statements and threats. It was getting to be too large of a compendium. There you are interrupting my nights. Fuck all, huh? On a holiday, too. On a holiday, too. So you were up there 45 minutes watching and didn't introduce yourself. I guess that says something about you. I'm getting that impression. Yeah. Um. He might be right. I don't really want to cut the camera off. That's a split decision. Uh, I'll do this. I'll, go, I'll head over to the sheriff's station right now, and I'll let them know what's going on. How's that sound? Let's just wait here for the cops. I'm sure they'll come. You you heard the call. I put it on speakerphone. Let's let's hope that they'll be. Yes, it is. I'll go. Seven forty-five. I'll go straight to the sheriff's station, and I'll let them know exactly what happened. You can uh. They've noticed I'm limping. My terroristic threat.
Oh, I'm gonna post it. Trust, I'm gonna post. Uh, that's the thing. I don't agree with you on the private property thing. I say you in the wrong spot. The sidewalk ends right here where my foot is. The fakes. For your information, there's parallel parking immediately around the corner. If someone wants to talk to me, they can pull over right there. There's a whole bus stop. It's fairly routine, but twice a day, someone will get out, come talk to me. After dark, that's not really surprising. People getting out to talk to you does does substantially cut back after dark. I don't know, man. You heard the call. Put it on speakerphone. They said they were sending someone. The guy that leads the group that's after me is a repeat offender child molester. And he's a cop watcher that I met on accident five years ago. Do your research. Get on Google. Richard Crowell, Megan's Law Pedophile. I said, if the Troll Brigade Mafia destroys my life. Yeah, well, look it up. Look it up. Yeah, well, guess what? Conditional statements are part of First Amendment freedom of speech. There's no direct threat there. I've heard a lawyer and judge go at it. I've already been 52 50 for it. It's not meant to get people on my side. It's meant to scare the other members of the Troll Brigade Mafia. I got the idea from them. Years ago, some of the members became concerned and talking amongst themselves, hey, if this dude really kills himself, it could cause repercussions. He could come back on us. We've gone too far. That was like 2016. The members of this group said they had gone too far. And I ran with the idea. That there could be repercussions for their harassment. Get out of our city and don't come back. Yeah, I kind of like it here. Oh, well, we don't like you here. So what? You know, the police are going to get enough harassment orders. And They're going to chase me out. Do have a car. Loud exhaust. Sounds sporty. This is a bottleneck lot. They have to come out up there. Or go in, they can keep going into the theater parking lots. 
I don't see him coming here. I assume the building is circular, like you can get around it. I don't even know. I've never been on the far side of it. I see no headlights. All the way around there on the far end. I'm way too far away from my shit. <sighs> but it'd be a downhill run if I went for it. And I can easily run that. That's gonna be a no. Exhaust note was very distinctive. It must have gone around the back way. If it passes me, I'll hear it rev up. No, no, no. I'm looking back too. I'm pointing the camera forward. I'm looking over my shoulders. I can see the tip of my stuff. So they were up here in this lot. And they were trying to claim that's public. That is a private office complex. These roads are even marked. Like this turn in, this is obviously a parking lot thing here, but even the next one is marked private drive. It's the theater parking lot. They must have gone back there through the theater. I think you can even get behind the theater. <clears throat> hmm. I have to go back and review what they said, but something met community message board I've been tipped off by people before. The Trouble Game Mafia is there stirring shit. That's an old tactic, though. I mean, it's old as in they've been doing it for a long time. Make sure my shoes are laced up tight. Fucking pussies. Coming up this bank, you see how high of a bank that is right there? Steep ass bank. I'd have little chance that like he'd be able to dominate me coming up that. I would have no chance. Did he wait the prescribed time? 7.43 at this exact moment. And his clock apparently read the same as mine. They were synced up earlier, so no. <laughs> um... I rarely, like, I don't use Facebook like that. I definitely don't get involved in local community groups. But the pedophile has it on block almost all the time. So I barely fucking, I barely do anything, and that's not something I do at all. That's sporty. But that exhaust note was loud. It was very distinctive. I should have fucking just climbed the bank. It's not like I'm incapable of fucking doing it. That may have been a mistake. I should have just fucking tried to climb the bank quickly. What What's falling and scraping your knee to catch the details of a stalker? I'm trying to run my ass out of town, niggas. I just moved. I've lived in Torrance longer than I've lived any place. Any place. Now I get what they're saying about the 99 cent store too. A little fight with the security guard there of me standing up to the evangelical, what was it, Pentecostal preachers out front. 
and the security guard shut me down. Yeah, that's Colton Wood Vlogs. All right, they admitted it. It's Colton Wood Vlogs. I have no control over that. That is the pedophile. It's the most prolific, biggest pedophile alias there ever was. But, um, yeah, that's, that's, that's them. Now I'm really kind of disappointed in the police because they we've already seen today. I got video of them here harassing me today. They had two officers harassing me here today, 20 minutes, something like that. Parking, blocking this lane, blocking that lane, taking all the time because they got a call. And you could tell by their demeanor when they got here, the call must not have been bullshit because they didn't ID me and fucking make me sit down and detain me and do anything to me. Of course, I'm not doing anything, but standing at the edge of the town center, flying my sign, very, this is Halloween day, by the, by the way. So... I can see him from here. 20 minute video. I guess I'm gonna have to cut it now for space after all. But, uh, if they drive by right here, I'll be able to hear that exhaust for sure. I'll be able to cut the camera back on. No, they went out the other direction.